some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Birmingham, Alabama with Mick Rusty and wife, uh, Georgia Transparency and Lana of J-Town Press as well. They get kicked out of the local courthouse, chased out, and, uh, well, you'll have to see the rest, but it ends up with them wanting to file an LOL lawsuit on the courthouse. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. GT and the J-Town Press went hot in Jefferson County, Alabama, in Jefferson County, Alabama, in the city of Birmingham. Please make sure to like, share, subscribe, and smash that notification bell right quick, fast, and in a hurry. Security Officer Louie appeared to want to get very physical and try to arrest me for merely existing in public with a camera. To make matters worse, this security officer stated that if he pulls his gun out, he is going to shoot me. This created a panic as I started to run for the front door. Oh, really? Uh, he wanted to... Uh arrest you for simply existing with a camera. Okay, Rusty Boy, it didn't have anything to do with the fact that you were entering a uh, family courthouse, uh, one which has an established policy of not bringing any recording devices in there, which, if it was uh, unconstitutional, and you know this, Rusty Boy, that it would have been overturned by now. Also, I noticed that you uh, switched the narrative up a little bit so you could cover your ass, because later on in the video, you say he's going to shoot you, uh, but that's not actually what he said, and you corrected yourself in the commentary right here, saying that he would shoot you if he pulled his gun out. So maybe you were trying to cover your ass, so that way you don't get sued or charged with anything. I mean, smart move, dude. At least you're that intelligent. Zaytown arrived at the same time, and, and at the same time, the security guard attacked her for standing on a public sidewalk recording with a camera. You've got to see this one to believe it. Oh yeah, I'm sure it had nothing to do with the fact that Lana likes to go around with that snide attitude and saying that they have absolute rights to uh, film anywhere and everywhere without your permission, even if it's a uh, public forum or non-public forum or anything like that. Hell, Lana doesn't give a damn about anybody but Lana. Let's check it out. Um, Rusty, uh, I am really concerned about your health at this point. Uh, I mean, I know you're quite large, but I can hear you breathing rather heavily. Uh, is there a problem with your heart there, buddy? Because, well, you should be concerned. Yeah, just anywhere in public. I mean, I'm not going to the courtroom or anything. I can't come in this building. Of course you can. Wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. Uh, of course you can, sir. Okay. Yes, you can. Okay. Why not? Because. Because why? This is a court of law. This is not. You go out out and go in any other room. Is this a federal building? No, it's not a federal building. It's a county. Oh, then I would like to come in and check out the public areas of the building then. Okay. Why not? You can't bring cameras in here. Of course you can, sir. No, you cannot. I'm telling you, you can. I'll tell you what. I'm a supervisor. Yeah, you might want to do that. Rusty boy, uh... How often are you wrong about the places you go into, about the the ability to film in there? Because I don't think you understand the concept of uh, limited to non-traditional public 
forums. Or maybe you do, you just don't really give a damn about them. I mean, I'm not sure at this point. Not to mention that this is a family court and there might be children roaming around here at some point. But like I said, you don't give a damn, do you? about other people oh yeah rusty boy that much is definitely clear at this point you don't give a damn about other people yeah so you lack that uh emotion uh what's it called uh oh yeah empathy you lack empathy don't you sir don't pull your gun out on me don't pull my gun out on you shoot oh, oh my god serious oh sh seriously dude that's the best one. Stay up there. Get your supervisor here. Are you cussing me? Get your supervisor. Sir. No, sir. Uh-uh. No, sir. Oh, shit. Here he comes. Oh, come on. Call 911. Call 911. Hey! Hey! Come here! Come here! Oh, yeah. Uh, when you feel afraid, you go to the uh, police and you want them to enforce your feelings that you got scared. So you want them to make sure that you feel all nice, warm and fuzzy and safe because the big bad security guard chased you out of the courthouse because you didn't give a damn about the judge's ruling about uh, me the media policy within that particular courthouse. Yeah, so it's all about feelings, isn't it? You just don't want to admit it. Come, I need help. I need help right now. I need help. Seriously, I need freaking help. I need help. He said he's going to shoot me. Inside. Yes. Yes, he said he's going to shoot me and kill me. Flashback. Because we've already had uh, commotion with people taking cameras. I don't care. I don't care about other people. Sir, don't pull your gun out on me. If I pull my gun out on you, I'm gonna shoot you. Oh, oh my god. Serious? Oh, sh seriously, dude? End of flashback. Oh, I said that. I think you're lying. Please, I need f***ing help. Oh, I'm a person that handcuffs on you. No, you're not. Get, please, I need help. I need help. I need freaking help. You will get here here again? Louie. Yeah, that's both of y'all. I don't remember y'all. I don't care, dude. No. Yeah, I remember y'all. And I've been in there. Louie. Oh, shit. Uh oh. oh my hey, help. Oh my help. Help. Oh help. Hey, my get my him. Hey. He grabbed her. Hey. Let go of my stuff. Get him. He's he can't do that. Get off my stuff. Get off my stuff. Dude. Get off my stuff. Get off my stuff. Bam. What the heck? He's grabbing all of my stuff. Get off my arm. Get off my stuff. What the fuck was up with him? What is up with him? Get back. I will defend myself. One more time. One more time. You touched her. Grab me, mother. Get off me. I will defend myself. No. Sir, please. Sir. Sir. You get him off me. Sir. You get him off me. Sir, sir, I'm, e I'm existing in a public place with a camera, working on a story. I'm a journalist. He's flipping out and trying to arrest me. Words are real. Okay, uh, Rusty boy. Uh, I've got a few concerns here. Uh, I had to obscure that child in this uh, video because you never bothered to do so. Sure, you took out some swear words, but you didn't take that child out. 
Now, uh, the other concern is if you are actually uh, working on a story, then uh, why didn't you go to the uh, media department for the local courts and ask permission to film inside of this uh, courthouse? Because, well, uh, I'm sure they do have forms for that. I mean, if you were really a journalist, you would know that you would know to go to their media department. I didn't see what happened. He just grabbed me by the damn hair, sir. No, I literally walked up. I didn't see what happened. I need an ambulance, please. We got a. Okay, I need an ambulance, please. Hey, what's what's going on? I was hey, sir, recording on Mr. the street. Mr. Hines. And I was is he the same supervisor that falls under y'all? Because he's threatening my friend with a gun. He just said that he was going to okay. pull out his hey, gun and hey, shoot him. Hey, do me a favor. Just stand he back. Grabbed, he grabbed the back of hey, my just, hair. Just stand back off the street till we get some some understanding, okay? This, he just he just grabbed me by the back of my hair and I think he ripped through my. Hair. All right, guys, we are in. Uh, right now, I think you might have. Broken. We're in Birmingham. Here he comes again. Here he comes again. Please protect me. Oh my goodness, look at these two frauditors who love to go around bullying everybody they see. And when there's somebody who exerts the smallest bit of power over them, they recoil and act like a couple little scared children. I mean, very pathetic, Rusty Boy. And shame on you, Lana, for losing your courage and acting like the cowardly lion in this particular scenario. This officer just threatened to shoot me and kill me in public for filming. Oh, you lying sack of crap. I mean, that's not why he did that at all. He didn't even threaten to, uh, well, end your life. He used the keyword if. So it was a conditional. There was no threat right there, dude. It was all in your little narrative. So stop bullshitting everybody. And, uh, well, i go ahead and show this to a judge at that, because you'll be laughed right out of court, I'm sure. And he just, he just put his hands on, uh, J-Town Press, he just put his hands on her in public. I think he just pulled my hair out. That's, that, that, that's, that's a crime. I want a press hey, charge. Hey, I'm in on the street. Uh, Chief? Oh, my God, are you his supervisor? Are you the supervisor? I need to talk to you, please. I, can I tell you what happened? Here, here, here. Can I tell you what happened? I have it on film, too. He's got it on film. So my, my friend here went in there. Well, hold on. No, no. I, I was here. Let me tell you my first part first. I first, I walked in here, and I walked up to the security checkpoint, and uh, he told me I couldn't film or take any pictures in there or something. So once I disagreed with him, he got very loud with me and told me he was going to shoot me. And then he chased me out the door with handcuffs trying to no, arrest me. got nothing to do with y'all. Have a good day. Wait, Birmingham said so who's going to arrest you? You're not going to arrest me. That's, that's the Did that happen out here? Did it happen? It happened right here. Outside. outside? Well, inside he threatened to shoot me. Outside he was chasing me with handcuffs to put me in jail for trying to do a report. Because we don't have anything to do with jumps to the cap. So even though this man is threatening to shoot me. One, two, one. No, we're going to get an attorney is what we're going to get. Okay. So what happened was he was standing about right where this, this first white square is. I was I walked across the street. He goes out and we did. You need to. The deputies need to handle it. It's their jurisdiction. for the adults. Okay. Okay. You step outside. You are not going to be in danger. You're no longer in danger. So you step outside and call in there. I'm calling I'm freezing cold. Okay, you step outside now. You can go back to your car again. You need to step outside. If I don't, what's going to happen? Step outside. So if I don't leave, what's going to happen? Uh, I'm going to go down and get a warrant for you for uh, so you gonna arrest for, for, for disobeying a lawful order. So, so I'm going to be arrested. For disobeying a lawful order. Okay, so I'm going to be arrested. For disobeying a lawful order. I'm not debating you. So you're going to arrest me if I don't leave? Step outside. Do I have to go too, sir? Step outside. What's your name? Can I get your name, sir? I mean, is it locked? I think it's locked. Did they lock it? Can I get your name, sir? Can I get your name, sir? There you go, sir. I think it's the other door. Are we locked in? Step outside. I can't. We're locked in. Please don't shoot me, dude. Please don't freaking shoot me. Can I get your get name? Get your hair on. Come on, step Come on. outside. Can I get your name, sir? Do I have to go out, too? 
but we're in public. I'm working on a story. I know. We'll try to get your hair combed so you look decent. Can I get your name, sir? Y'all just aren't identified. Y'all may have just earned a freaking lawsuit. Can I get your name, sir? You identify? Can I get your name, sir? Wow. I just threat of arrest. Yeah, I have to agree. There's a good LOL lawsuit going on right there. I mean, you filmed everything that went on, and it would look beautiful in a court when the judge takes a look at it and uh, laughs his ass off, and, uh, well, you will be laughed right out of court at that time. So, Rusty Boy, uh, yeah, you might want to continue to film your... Uh, interactions like this because they can and will be used to court against you. So, have a nice day, you buffoon. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?